Well, we're out here in Western Oklahoma at Canadian River Hilton, blessed to be back. Just got through dialing in the Steyr rifle, it's ready to go. Opening day of whitetail rifle season is tomorrow. And over the years, all the times I've been out here, I've always hunted Oklahoma, but Justin also has some Texas dirt. So this year, I'm actually whitetail hunting the Canadian River Hilton Texas dirt for the first time. So that's kind of cool. We're in a blind, open country out here, obviously. Travel spots, you know, trying to catch a deer coming from up top. I think he said over here to our left is uh, some wheat and stuff. And they're gonna come off of that and head back to the this tree row over here to our right. Let's see if we can't get it done. Matt, I absolutely love this kind of hunt. Covering ground, just classic spot installing. This country is tailor-made for, of course, you know it like the back of your hand. That's what we've been doing, guys. We've been covering ground. We hunted this morning for just a little bit, sitting still in a blind, and then Matt said, hey, let's be proactive. Let's bounce around, cover ground. I got rattling antlers, just the ruts that time of year, and I love this kind of hunt. So what are you thinking, Matt? Come stay in these draws and then pop up. There's a big pop bowl up. over this hill. Yeah. There's, there's a bunch of deer hanging out in this bowl before they go to that wheat field. And I imagine there's more bowls and stuff all over the place. So. Yeah, we can glass this bowl and then there's nothing there. Maybe do some rattling or something. And then move on to the next spot. Yes, all this shin oak stuff, shinnery oak. I love that. Yeah, I mean, it produces acorns and they- Acorns, they bed up in it, yes, the whole nine yards. So anyway, that's our approach. Canadian River Hilton, Panhandle of Texas. I mean, there's deer everywhere out here, and hopefully we can find us a good shooter. We got about an hour till dark, and we're gonna hunt hard till we get it done, hopefully. And it's only day one. Can 
gotta ease up a little bit. Yeah, he's right there. Let's pull up that good one dough. He don't want to have a clue. Wind's good. All right, I'm gonna ease up and try to find him. Oh, I see his antler shining right there. Oh my gosh, that's a big deer, dude. That's a definite shot. That's a big deer. Big one, big one, big one. I gotta adjust this. You see? Let me get adjusted here. We got time, don't we? Oh my gosh, that's a that's a good bug. That is a good bug. Heavy bug. That sun's glaring. I ain't got a shot. He, his vitals are covered up. Is that he just must be looking at his dough? I guess we just wait him out, huh? The doe's up, the doe's up. You see the doe? All right, he's moving to the right. He's moving to the right. All right, Preston, we got him. All right, he, he, he's, he's just still chilling. He's looking back our way. Just his head's up looking at us. Be ready to blow a grunt or something. You got the buck. You got him, Preston? As soon as he stops, as soon as he stops. All right, right there, y'all. All right now, ready? He's down. He is down, boys. Unbelievable. Yes, sir. Spot and stall, quite tail, Texas style. Oh my goodness. How cool was that, That's man? Awesome. First kill. I felt good about it. And when he, he took off running up, I bolted him over and I said, let me get ready. And he tipped over. Matt, come around here. Come around here. Matt Kiker, Canadian River Hilton, the man. Hey, look, thank you, dude. I appreciate that. Hey, it's our first day. And uh, Matt said, hey, we're gonna spend some time in blinds, but we're gonna move around. We're gonna we're gonna glass this open country. We're gonna rattle. He's got rattling antlers. Who knows what we'll see? And then he just knows this country. You know where these deer are. And he told us right down here in this little hollow right here. He said, "I'm gonna ease up there and look off in this bowl. It's always deer in there." And I'd be dead gum if Matt didn't pop up and look back, just as calm as can be. Yeah, big mature buck right here. Ease up here and take a look at him and see if you want to shoot him, kind of deal. Everything was perfect. He didn't have a clue we were in the world. He was fixed on that dough. Man, big time thanks again. He's down. I'm ready to go over there and check him out. We'll be able to do it well before dark. Get some pictures and we'll get him back to camp. Heck yeah, sounds good to me. Let's go do it. That spot and stalk hunting is, is incredibly fun. And we don't get to do it whitetail very often. It's usually you know, every now and then, maybe every other year or so, it's elk and occasional mule deer. But to get to do it on a whitetail is pretty dang fun. I'll tell you that much. He's got to be right here somewhere. We're in a two-track road to a ranch road. He's got to be right here somewhere. 
That's the plum thicket. He took off running. Hang on, where? There he is. He's right there. Right there. What a tank. Holy cow, guys. Wow. What a tank of a North Texas buck, y'all. Good gracious. Man, look at this deer, guys. Preston, look how big this deer is. I mean, a massive 10 point, good, I mean, just everything about him's good. He's massive. The body is incredible. There's no doubt this deer is ancient, six, seven years old. Big old giant, swole up, rut neck, big old blockhead. I mean, a tank of a buck. I can't believe it. I'm stoked, y'all. I mean, I am fired up. First day, Canadian River Hilton, hunting in the Texas Panhandle. All these years we've hunted in Oklahoma with Justin and crew. And uh, he's always had some Texas dirt. And he said, hey man, you wanna hunt Texas? I said, heck yeah, let's do Texas. So we did Texas. Just thankful for the opportunity to get to do this. Blessed beyond measure. Thank the good Lord for the resource. Thank you, Lord, for the white-tailed deer. Thank you for good friends and great places to hunt. Unbelievable. What a buck. <laughs>